What's up guys? Welcome to this video on Elvis is the Man. So it turns out this year is actually a pretty good year for Priscilla and all Priscilla Bolyul fans. I mean Presley, whoops. Alright guys, some of the latest news here. Three big things for Priscilla. Oh man, this is such a great year for her. Okay, so... It appears as though Priscilla is going to be paid $1.4 million by granddaughter Riley. So she's going to get a million and then $400,000 to cover her legal fees. Now what happened was, for some of you who didn't know, Priscilla challenged Lisa's 2016 amendment to her will, putting Riley, her oldest daughter, as the sole trustee of Graceland in the Elvis Presley estate. So it was Lisa's. And now it'll be changed to Riley's. Well, Priscilla disputed this because she says that it may not be valid. She wanted to check the authenticity of it because Lisa took Priscilla out of the will. She just left it to her daughter, Riley. Well, Priscilla doesn't want to be cut out. Long story short, some of the details came out. And for Riley to be the sole trustee, she's going to give her grandmother... $1.4 million. And during these contract negotiations, Priscilla requested to be buried right next to Elvis. Right next to. So maybe Minnie Mae had to be moved or Vernon had to be moved so Priscilla could be put there. But they said, no, that's not going to happen. But it does turn out after all, it appears as though Priscilla will be buried in the meditation garden. But no grave sites are going to be moved, unfortunately. Aw. But yeah, it looks like every time we get to go there from now on, when Priscilla eventually does pass away, that'll be a sad day, we will be able to see her grave too. So 2023, Priscilla looks like she'll be buried at Graceland in the Meditation Garden eventually when that day comes. She says next to the love of her life, I'm assuming she meant Elvis, she's going to be paid 1.4 mil and guess what, guys? I don't know if you may have forgotten, but there's going to be a Priscilla and Elvis movie. Another one. Yeah. So we had the greatest Elvis movie of all time come out last year. Elvis is looking great in the public eye. It was a great PR movie for Elvis. But now, you know what? The book Elvis and Me, which came out in the mid 80s. Remember where she says that Elvis took her and stuff like that? Well, they're going to make a movie of that. It's going to be a Priscilla movie talking about their love life and, and how they met. And oh, it's going to be so great. I can't wait for this movie to come out. Joking. Like we really need another movie about Elvis. Right after, like, I don't know, for those of you who've read the book, it's not really putting Elvis in the best light. But Priscilla's going to be the star. Oh my gosh. So that movie is supposed to come out towards the end of this year. A trailer, I bet, is I think is uh, set to come out within this week. So, oh man, this is actually turning out to be such a great year for her. Priscilla's 78. Reports say that her and her granddaughter Riley aren't talking. I wonder why. Um, some of Lisa's friends say this is just all a money grab pot by Priscilla, but I'll let you be the judge of that. Um, anybody wants to dispute these things that I'm saying, just Google it. I'll put some of the, uh, articles in the description below. Um, check it out. As far as I know, this seems to be accurate, but you come to your own conclusions. <laughs> Man, Priscilla Presley or Boyu. I wonder what's going to be on the grave. Is it Priscilla Presley? I don't know. Let's not even think about that sad day when it comes. All right, guys, that's a little bit of Elvis news. Elvis is the man news. Talk to me in the comments. Tell me your thoughts. Tell me if you love it. Tell me if you hate it. Tell me if you think it's uh, Priscilla's a money grabber or if maybe she just misinterpreted. You know, maybe she's just, uh, maybe Elvis fans just want to put her as the villain when maybe, you know, she just was the love of Elvis's life. Elvis never got over her. And then she just saved Graceland for us. I don't know. Tell me your thoughts down below. Talk to you next time. <laughs> Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, my gosh. I almost forgot. So Priscilla's son, Lisa's half-brother, Navron, or however you pronounce his name, somehow got one-ninth of Lisa Marie Presley's estate. Whew. Explain that one.
celebrating other people's birthday. So this is our chance to give him a big hug and celebrate him and say, happy birthday, Elvis. Happy birthday, Elvis. <laughs>